Well, hello! And welcome back to Fallout New Vegas with your truly loves in the the mad. I love the process army, just speak to include 23 boxes. Man, could this it is 13 and orange. Now, um, this guy just. Yeah. Alright, um, cool. It's a good thing I started recording before I loaded into the game because otherwise I would have missed that. Not that I reloaded to do that or anything, yeah. I, that, that would have been extremely silly. Exceptionally so. Uh, hello. I see he's going to his post, which is good because that's where we want him. Um, I did grab the salmon, right? Yeah. Uh, I should just mention that the previous episode was recorded in May. Now, I... Uh, Finished editing it in last week, but you know, I kind of just skipped through it, skimmed through it because I knew it was going to be a lot of time spent in me trying to actually find where the fudge was supposed to be going. And in that goal, I did repeatedly fail quite a few times, yes. Alright, what do we have? Chips? I'll take him. Are you the store of the safe? Because I remember there was a safe that was very hard. Exceptionally difficult. Now this might have been it. Because it certainly seems pretty difficult. Oh wait, wait, was it moving? No. Yes, maybe I don't know. Okay, try again. No, it was certainly moving somewhere around here. Not there. Quite certainly not there. The cursor, it distracts me. It's in there at the edge of the game and it's just grabbing all of my attention. All of it. When I move it to the center, it disappears, but then it appears at the edges like that and it's just so distracting. Good. I don't even know how to move the pin apparently. Yeah, I... Video games, how do they work? Yeah? And there's not even all that good stuff in here. Like, who would actually install a very hard lock for that? You know? Like, okay, maybe they were just like, yeah, I'll get a good save. Maybe there's like a deal with uh, the boss man. Like, he just handed out these nifty things I didn't account for the fact that you know people are just gonna store some chips in them and maybe one stack of pre-war money that's actually a lot of money hi yes yes that's exactly what you're doing right now wait huh the big boy works with the counter? You think he's using the big boy to establish the projector connection? Huh. Think he might be close then? Any idea where? Ah, so maybe not towards the casino but in any other direction. Show her the big boy. Uh huh. Alright, good for you. Why do you think he wants you to go to the Puesto del Sol switching station? Either Dean or Dog have the technical aptitude to man the switching station. Okay, cool. 
Let's go. Oh, I don't have... Uh... Things would be a lot easier if you did one snap for yes, two snaps for no. Does it work, eh? Alright. Okay, okay, I get it. Better than finger snaps. Let's go. We got a location for you. We'll get you relatively fixed up. We can't fix you up properly though, but you know. We'll get you in a state of uh, being that will be of more use. Hello. Come on. Uh, I need you to follow me. Yes. There we go. I probably should have mentioned that earlier, yeah? Yeah. Okay, we know where she's supposed to be going because that's where we were at an earlier spot in time. You know, we should... Clean up time a little, it's kind of spotty. Yes. Ah, yes. Now, mind you, um, I should be careful because people might respawn and I am not at very high health. Alright, I'll hold my gun at the ready. Or are you saying that if you go up here, you'll kill my ass? Which would be a shame, I like my donkey. Oh. I don't know, that was a bit unexpected, I didn't admit. I wasn't expected at all. Uh, when did I get this many steam packs? I guess using them, you know, sparingly is... A Good idea in general. I can't sleep up here. Well, now I know why those traps are here because apparently, where there are traps, ghost people are not far behind. What was that? Yes, uh, no. Get in my belly. Uh, kids. Don't eat, cig eat cigarettes. Yeah, don't put them in your belly. It's a terrible idea. And honestly, that joke doesn't even work very well. Even if I hadn't said that thing by accident at first. Um. That's not the way you can be headed. Also, don't get beheaded. <laughs> yeah. That's... that won't be good. Right, we can grab this. You can thank me for killing that bugger. In May. Like, literally in May. That was... So long ago. Do you want to go in this area? Do you need to use the service route? Or do we still need to use the exact same route as we did last time and I'm just forgetting how to use it? Apparently you want to go over here. To the left. Oh yeah, watch out for the traps because, you know. They appear to spawn whenever they wish to. If there is an enemy nearby, from my understanding. At first I thought, who is that lady over there? Why is she crying? Then I realized this is for New Vegas, and that is not an animation this game has. So that's not something I should worry about. Uh, that cloud doesn't look very large, so let's just walk through it. Oh, no, this is still 
a cloud. Guess it was an angled thing. All right. You must be ready for anything. A uh, good thing you have that thingy. Your special magic ability of making me less likely to die. Oh, electrical switch on the wall that needs a handy twist. This one? Okay. Like that? Cool. Tick, 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 tick. Boom. 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 Like, who was kind enough to leave that message? That could, have, could not have been healthy. Very kind, though. Very kind. Mind you, I'm gonna expect there to be TikTok messages for all of them now. Okay, the beeping is getting louder. I have no idea where it is, so my head may explode. Nope. Thank you. Uh, I think it's below us somewhere. Okay, this area is. Oh. This area is pretty shit, that's what it is. Alright, but, but can we jump it? Hell to the no, but I'll try. I didn't jump it. I did in fact fail the jumping. But this side is this toxic, so um good for me. And the only question is how the fuck do we get back up there? Uh Geronimo! Run run for my life. Run for the stairs. Um also um like, shove a million steam packs up my throat? Like, that's not how you actually dose those things, but I'm gonna do that. Yeah. Because I'm a badass. With no abs absolutely no medical knowledge on how it works in this thing. Yes. Um, speaker. I better shoot it. Or is that like immune? Is my head gonna explode? Yes. There's also a trap. No, if my head is gonna explode anyway. Well, yeah, that makes sense. I would lose her perk if I died. Or if she died. Which honestly is pretty close to related situation. Why can't they destroy those speakers? What's wrong with them? What was the story with the red speakers? It was explained. I just don't remember. Ah, lockbox. Which actually is a, you know, a box with a lead, which apparently locks up in a magical manner that we are not entirely certain of. We're quite sure it's magic. Yes. Hello, terminal. In case of emergency, all non-essential systems are to be shut down immediately to help the automatic systems balance the load. Should the automatic systems fail, your foreman will assign one of you to enter the manual override chamber located adjacent to the main regulator. The boys hit behind the gas are still out, everyone's pulling more work in as a result, and crumbling starting. Mr. Yesterday's been keeping the hard liquor, and Kim's coming under Sinclair's eye isn't helping. We need those boys back, we haven't another chemical leak, we have another chemical leak like that, no more construction for the rest. 
I failed to read that sentence completely. These new chemical suits came in today, so we could check out the ventilation chambers, see how that cloud cocktail formed. Suits are kind of creepy looking, hard to talk in them, so we had to use sign language to actually make sense of each other. At least we can check out the pipes and ventilation chambers now. Gas worries me though. Really mess the guys up. If the chambers get backed up again, I hate to see the gas get out right at the villa. Oh, is that the cloud? This must be the cloud. Hello? Oh, you want that terminal, eh? But oh, there's a there's Ennis's locker here. And there's also this stuff. I can take it. And an automatic rifle. Which is not an actual way to pronounce anything, but you know. Oh, nice. And here. Toxic samples. Cool. And here. Alright, this was a very hard lock, wasn't it? So, unless I remember how to do these things. I had 31 bobby bomb pins. And like when we get back, we're having more stuff. Um, how do you work? Ah, but we're activating it. Cool. Let's learn about fixing things. We should have grabbed a wrench. We all know wrenches are the only way to actually fix things. Um, where are you, speaker? Why can't I shoot you? What the hell's wrong with you? Oh, I just went down. Alright, that's cool. That's completely unlethal. I saw something. Oh, it's a Mark II turret. Okay, there's a lock here. I need to get past. Mitch succeeded. Then I need to get into this terminal. It's a uh, ghost. No, it's... Soon will work. Yeah, okay. Soon. Trademark. Uh, come on, come on, come on, let's lock the fuck in and turn speakers the fuck off. Thank you. One, two, or four speakers are offline, please contact it to resolve. Didn't take long to find the problem. Heading down the main pipe, we hit traces of the gas. Not the full red stuff like last time though, minor blessing. The kicker was despite the sealant, it still got inside the suit. Turns out the gas eroded the metal of the suit's locks. So not only did one of the boys get exploded, everyone who went down there got locked in the suits. Yep, that's how ghost people are born. Uh, are you going to go and punch the thing? I want to see you punch the thing. Should I give her a weapon? I really should have thought of that, shouldn't I? Yeah. Alright, well. Hey, uh, Christine. Like, have a gun. I'm not sure what sort of gun should I should give you. I think I had something that uses... I think you should be good with laser weapons, you were Brotherhood of Steel, so was the weapon I had an actual laser rifle of some sort or I had a laser pistol but I'm sure I had something a rifle as well that wasn't no it probably only was. Alright, I have some electric cells, I'm sure you should be fine for them actually, never mind, so uh, still. Better safe than sorry. I should use this gun. Oh, that actually was my number four. Cool. Oh, and number five was my laser pistol, which I just gave away. And this is key, which I no longer need because I already opened the thingy. 
Old man Ennis left his key on one of the consoles again, so I'm making this note to remind myself to give it back next time I see him. We should stuff his locker full of dandy boy apples or something, maybe then he'd be less forgetful. Sure, the dogs at the clinic got mad, but we didn't have any choice if we wanted to get medical attention after that gas hit us. So we got his suit open with one of the surplus steak knives, things could cut through a T-bone like it was hot butter. The rest of us tried to pry the locks on our suits, finally had to use the knives on ours too. Can't wait until this job is over and we can let the villa collapse on itself. They were too busy at the casino anyway. Come on up. Okay, remote maintenance terminal and this one is... In case of emergencies, power regulation procedures can be carried out from this station. However, this practice is not recommended for regular use. Please see your supervisor concerning whether use this use of this station is warranted. I think it's warranted. Uh, I found a way to do the bypass from here. You should be able to just use the terminal over there. Okay. Alright, be ready. Cool. The bell tower. That's where you'll trigger the gala event. It's a ways up. I'm sure you'll find a way to climb up there. Alright, well, thank you. Time for us to go and trigger the gala event, so... Thanks for watching. I'll see you then. You know... Moving on the ground is for, you know, ground walkers, but we have evolved past that, thanks to our high levels of radiation.